Happy November 22nd, everyone. I'm Liam, and we are playing the 2024 quest calendar, The Leaf Riders of Renwood. Yesterday, Ivy found a cave behind a waterfall from within which can be heard a disturbing noise. So, of course, we entered, and that is where we left things. So, let's see what adventure is on the calendar for us today. Oh, dear. As you make your way behind the waterfall... Approaching the cave's entrance, the echoing sound of splashing fills your ears, growing steadily louder. You pivot to investigate, only to witness a feral otter emerging from the water, its eyes aflame with an unnatural and unsettling fury. Okay. Uh, five rounds of combat with this guy. Attack, damage, defense. Um... Round one. Oh, interesting. Okay. So we normal though this is set up a little bit differently than we normally see. Uh, if you let's see, if you hit and your damage roll equals or exceeds the enemy's health for that round, the enemy is stunned uh, this round and cannot attack you. Oh, that's cool. If you miss, the enemy's not stunned and it attacks you. Okay. So. He's got different healths for each round, and if we if we manage to hit those, we stun him and he doesn't get to attack. And okay, here we go. Round one. It lunges at you, jaws snapping shut with lightning speed, aiming to sink its razor-sharp teeth into your flesh. We want to beat his defense of 18. We get a 19, so we do. Ivy does 3d8 damage. Here's my eight-sided die. We want... 16 damage and we get 7 8 9 plus 3 is 12 can we get four more points of damage uh well huh. we've got a few ways to do that we have three party four now three party member yeah three party members who can help us with damage 7 8 9 um 10 11 12 4 we need four more points. How badly do we need this? Let's see if our party members can help us. That's what they're here for. So, we've got... Uh, we need to look them up. Vinny, Brindle, and Kit. So... Vinny. Vinny can add one damage. If uh, Brindle could add three, and Kit could add a D4, so Kit alone could do it. So, let's try Kit first. Kit needs a club greater than or equal to six, and he does not get it. And I think aces are low, so that's, uh, right, that's okay. Not a face card, so he doesn't get hurt. Uh, now, if we want our pets or our party members alone to help us, we're going to need both Brindle and Vinny to come through. So I'm going to draw two cards and, well, actually, let's do Brindle first. Because if Brindle doesn't, doesn't activate, then there's no use in trying Vinny. Because we need Brindle's plus three damage. So he needs a club greater than or equal to six, and he does not get it. So that's Brindle and Kit out of the running for this entire page <laughs> we have Vinny still left he can help us um let's see damage what else can we do ivy has solar flare um i think we'll go ahead and use it because again that's what it's there for so solar flare adds a d4 how many solar flares let's just use them until we get them Oh, we have our boon die. Let's do that. We'll do our boon die as well. That's a three. Excellent. So now we just need one point. So now our solar flare will surely get us there. Where's the one? <laughs> Here it is. We need one more point. That's the boon die spent. And the solar flare, we're going to mark off a single surge. And we don't need to roll this really, but for fun, there we go. And we hit this thing. Here's the page. Uh, that was the damage, right? We do enough damage, so he's stunned. 
So that's round one. Round two, the otter swings its tail, its spike end aimed at you like a weapon, attempting to jab it into your side. All right. We want to hit a defense of 17 this round. There we go. Nine plus our attack of eight is 17. So we hit him and we need to do 18 damage if we want to stun him. That's going to be pretty tough. Seven, 10, 11 plus three is 14. Again, we need four more points of damage. So we still have Vinny who can help us. Let's try Vinny. I'm pretty sure it's a club greater than or equal to seven. So what do we get? Nope. Okay, so that's Vinny out of the running. We have solar flares left, so let's do those. Here's our first solar flare is a two. We need two more points. And we get it with another two. So that's two more solar flares. And the feral otter is stunned again for round two. Three rounds to go. Round three. The otter rakes its long claws across your limbs, leaving deep and bloody scratches. Oh dear. Uh, not if not if we stun them, I hope. <laughs> okay. Uh, we want to beat his defense of 18. We get a 20. That's our boondi back. Excellent. So we hit him, and now we want to do 15 points of damage if we want to stun him this round. So... Here we go. 7 plus 7 is 14, plus 3 is 17, so we stun him. So, round 4. The otter charges at you in a berserk fury, aiming to bowl you over with its powerful body. Okay, we still have our boon die. We want to beat his defense of 17, and we get it. 14 plus 8. Uh, it's 22, easily. 19 damage we need to do if we want to stun him. This is going to be rough. Here we go. 10 plus 8 is 18, plus uh, 3 is 21. We stun him again. Round 4. Stunned. Round 5. The otter combines its sharp teeth and claws in a vicious combo attack, biting down on one limb while clawing at another. All right. Last round. We want to beat his defense of 19. We get a 14 plus 8, so we hit him. We want to do 17 damage. If we want to stun him. 8, 10, 11, plus 3 is 14. We need 3 more points of damage. I think we can get this. Let's use a solar flare, because that alone might do it. Ugh, 2. We need 1 more point of damage, so I think we'll have to use our boon die. And that's that. So, we don't even really need to roll that, but we will. And we get 1. Exactly what we needed. And that is the Feral Otter stunned all five rounds. Uh, let's see. If you didn't defeat the enemy, it dives under the water to flee from battle. I assume we have defeated it. Collect one amber for each round you stunned the enemy. So that's five. Collect D8 additional amber if you dealt a total of 20 damage or more uh, and defeated the enemy. I don't know how you could do one and not the other, but... I think we did. So we get a D8. We get 5 plus D8 amber. So 3. We get 8 more amber. That takes us to 102 amber. Oops. 102. Excellent. Triple digit amber. And that, my friends, is November 22nd. So we shall say goodbye for now and visit Ivy and friends again tomorrow. I hope you'll join us. Thanks for watching.